Right? I think so, yeah. Okay, yay! They will march behind the Rose flag, bearing an academic symbol of the degree ranking school. I'm that weird friend who, like, the generations and we honor their traditions, identities, and stories which are far too often ignored and erased. A distinction that includes an amazing 11 Olympic medals. The most of any female runner ever. Most recently at the 2020 Tokyo Olympics, she capped her capped her legendary Olympic career with a bronze in the 400 meters and a gold in the 4x400 meter relay. Congratulations to the parents, to all of you sitting out there, supporters. It has been such a difficult time. You have endured, you've persevered, and now I am so excited to share in this beautiful day as we congratulate you. I don't remember the first time that I stepped foot on this campus. My dad went here and I was raised a Trojan. As evidence of these degrees and certificates, I shall direct that an appropriate diploma of the University of Southern California be presented to each of you, signed by its officers and embossed with the seal of the University of Southern California. Congratulations, fight on, and if you want to throw your caps and retrieve them, you can do it right now. Woo! Woo! You're going to college? There are some the historians that I think. <laughs> make faces. Irene? <laughs> the next graduate of USC. Cheese! When she graduates from USC, we're gonna have another video. Fight on. Commencement is over. We're at the reception now, at the end's reception. We just had food. It's all gone, so I can't show it to you. Mom, you have any few words? No. no. I'm tired. That's all. <laughs> That's Levy Library. What? Levy Library. I think there's a ceremony. Oh, it's the Masters. 
Callum Lynn. Brianneth Rocha. I'll be showing you everything like how we've been setting up and we've been here since 7 a.m. and it's around 11 a.m. now. Um, so we've got most of it done, pretty much the um, base setup, and we'll be bringing the food and all the um, additional decoration pieces and centerpieces later today. But I want to show you guys my decoration so far to give like an inspo because when I was looking at Pinterest and online to find ways to decorate for my like affiliated to my university, it was really hard to find cute inspiration. I think there's a few, but they're very like out there, very really luxurious rooftop parties. So this is more of a, I think more of a realistic evening. So I'll be showing you that and I hope you guys like it and comment down below what was your favorite part. Oh, and if you have any questions, feel free to do that as well. My graduation party, I'm so excited for it. I'll, um, you guys will see me right now, but pretty much this is the setup. These are all my graduation pictures from um, pretty much my grad pictures and I haven't like posted them anywhere on social media or anything. And this will be like the first look at them. We wanted to do like a collage of that day. This is one of my favorite pictures. This one with the green grass is really nice. This is like from a, a ceremony I went to an, another day. And then my mom really wanted to like blow up some of the best ones. This is really one of my favorites. My This is my undergrad diploma. My master's diploma is still in the mail so I couldn't show it. And this is really cute next to the statue of the dog and my cap decoration. Commencement was yesterday, so I'm really exhausted from all that. But I hope this serves for inspo for someone else that's trying to figure out how to decorate for their graduation party from USC. I couldn't find much online or on Pinterest. Okay, now to the next one. This is where the, like all the desserts will be set up and everything. My mom got a good idea to put the sash up here. The little cap, my pins on it. I'll show you guys a shot once everything's on it, but it's gonna be full of cupcakes and chocolate, strawberries. Please don't mind my squeaky shoes. I really like the setup. I've never had like a birthday party or anything that's been the color red. I've always stick to my pastels and everything, but it looks really good. And I believe here's where they're gonna put food. Oh no, for presents and all that. The of class of, the of part popped on the way here. So it, it, I think it still serves its purpose class of 22 and then these stick-ons for pictures like um yeah they're the, pretty much you hold them up to take pictures oh no i messed up everything up i'll fix it for my mom <laughs> right now so that we like that'll look really nice and this is like the drinks and i set up the cocktails here if you guys hear some loud sounds in the background they're checking the speakers to make sure they work for the music later And this, this actual like banquet part is not fully decorated. We're still missing the centerpieces. They're at home and we're going to bring them later. And there's like some uh, outdoor tables, high rise tables over there. And I'll show you guys better once everything's fully set up. But here is where I'm gonna put the cake and like a flower arrangement and it's gonna be served. It's gonna be good for like pictures and all that. And behind that's the speaker. So we have to clean that up. So I'll show you, I'll show you guys once everything's done.